Really got it out the mud, think they forgot I had to get it out the mud, cause it was either that or drown Now they say a nigga dirty, but they won't ever say it to me They wait until I'm not around, I swear I wish I had the time y'all did Out here hating for free, I don't see why they hating on me It's probably cause a nigga gassing I've been grinding for the last few months, years all accurate God ain't give me that Bentley yet, cause he know I'ma act ass in it Probably get drunk somewhere, wanna bypass and up crashing it I came too far now, and I won't stop now I can't say that I dreamed of this, cause I've been up straight getting to it I want a bag and I'ma get it too. I chase it down like I'm Okay, 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 okay. I'm gonna drop my coffee. What's going on, y'all? It's your boy Kid B. Oh, and it's raining. Golly. Alright, hold on. Let me set myself up. Um, if you're new to this channel, if you don't know why you're here, if you're wondering what I'm doing or why I'm about to be getting wet you watching ybm tv um so for the last couple of days i've just been waking up having my morning coffee with y'all because i realized that i don't post enough videos and so i figured this would be a good way to uh you know get back into the swing of things shit oh 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 Okay, hopefully it's not too loud, but um, I'm going to just try to talk over the rain. I'm back, Mr. Magic City. Blowing color purple, I make you rain on your forehead. Alright, um. <laughs> Alright. So, yeah. You watching YBM TV? Um. I feel like I said that already. I did. Um, blah, blah, blah. I had my morning coffee with y'all. Okay, yeah. So it's raining. Um, it's kind of loud. When I edit, I don't know for sure if this footage is usable or not. But, um, so. This is what's been going on for the last couple of days. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. For the last couple of days, I come out here, have my morning coffee with y'all, you know, just to, you know, be comfortable with, you know, doing this shit. So, um, the last couple of days have been freaking awesome as far as, so, before the other day, I hadn't really posted no videos in 2020. One. Um, oh, shit. Right, so I um the only two videos that I remember posting this year were the um the Kobe and Gigi memorials. It's been a year and some months now, and then I posted a um a busted challenge compilation. Those are like the only two videos that I posted this year, and on top of that, both of those fucking videos. Um, couldn't get uh, monetized, <laughs> so I really did nothing at all this year from January 1st until a couple of days ago, and now, um, boy, my channel is like it's being revised pretty much, revived, not with the S, with the V's. Um, damn, it just started raining even louder, but yeah, so morning cup of coffee. Um, so if you're watching this video you know that um reverb nation is curating me hopefully for something special magical beautiful because uh, it's my time baby but um on a more lighter note so um i was on reverb yesterday you know playing around checking on you know my curation to see you know if everything was going okay or I needed to tap in or anything and um what happened oh so i was going through my opportunities and my um and my tools and different things like that and um they had a, a distribution option so um everybody i know that make music seriously is on like itunes and spotify and you know all this other stuff 
And uh, the only thing I ever knew about getting your music on like streaming platforms was that you had to pay for it. And like I said, I'm, I'm a broke ass nigga, no cap. I ain't, ain't got the money to be paying people to listen to my music when y'all don't listen to it for free, right? It's stupid. But um, so I'm just sitting on there looking. I'm really just looking. And um, I ended up reading. Well, they ended up, I don't know if it's a deal or if Reverb was just throwing me a bone. I don't know. But through Reverb for $10 a year, mind you, I only have to pay $10 once for the whole year, I can upload music on iTunes, Spotify, Tidal, um, I can sell it on YouTube, Pandora, um, Shazam will recognize my music, like it's just like just dope shit, like stuff that I just never really got into or like thought of to look into, but for $10, Every year, so it's 2021, I already paid my $10. I won't have to pay another $10 until 2022, if I make it that far. So, um, I was like, damn, you mean to tell me that my music could have been on iTunes and Spotify and on YouTube for $10 a year? That's crazy. But now the kicker is you have to own or at least have a lease agreement for your beats or else as soon as they get uploaded they're gonna flag your shit and that's scary because boy my youtube is already getting copyright uh right uh strikes and and all this other stuff and so i you know i'm really really trying to be careful with these music uploads because this is like i really really want to do music and the last thing i want to do is jeopardize any chance i have to make my music go further so um I'm definitely just studying, but I did pay that $10, and um, out of all of the songs that I have, even have access to, there's only one song that can go on all of these streaming platforms, and it is the beginning of 2021 freestyle. Why? Because my man, Ducey Montana, made the beat for me from scratch, and I own it. So that will be the only song that you guys will see on iTunes until I start generating me some income and then I start buying these beats. Or that nigga Ducey just gonna have to, you know, send me some beats. Now, um, my boy D Finn, he got, um, he sent me this beat like two years ago. And it's fire, but it's not structured for like a song. So it's not like hook, verse, hook, verse, or even verse, hook, verse, hook. It's just a two and a half three minute instrumental of just like fire like it just keep going and it's low-key lit so i'm probably about to use that as like a you know because i can split the song in half and make two different songs out of it or i can just you know you know i, I can play with it pretty much i can even use the instrumental to just put in the background of my um of my videos that way it ain't just quiet um and that's, you know, that's freaking dope. So, uh, I don't know why I've been sitting on this beat for so long, but I went to my emails and I found it and was like, damn, I, I could have been using this. So, I only got one song on streaming platforms right now and it's still under review. So, I did it last night. I, um, I was looking on the computer. I saw the opportunity, $10 a year. You can stream on pretty much every streaming platform. And so, I texted my little sister. I'm like, hey, G. I know you got $10 for your boy. She was like, yeah, I got you. Say less. We bought, well, nigga, we made it. So she sent me the money. I sent it to Reverb. And now I'm just waiting on them to tell me that it's a go. So as soon as I get the news that y'all can pick me up on Spotify and iTunes and Pandora and all of that shit, I'm going to get on here. I'm going to make the video. I'm going to let y'all know. And we're going to go from there. Um, right now, like I said, it's only the one song, beginning of 2021. I'm actually going to upload that song to YouTube. Um, that way Y'all can listen to it on YouTube too because no matter where y'all listen to it at I get money for it now So, you know, that's dope. I'm excited. I'm geek. There's been a lot of good shit happening for me Like I said, it ain't super extraordinary or it ain't really nothing to be like, oh my god Oh my god, you know, but like I, it's making me happy And so I'm geeked about that shit. No cap. Like can't nobody even really bring me down right now 
But, um, you know, morning cup of coffee. I just had to come in here and let y'all know what was going on with me. Um, I'm going to definitely be back tomorrow. So I'll probably be back tonight, you know. Two, two videos a day. I've been giving y'all this heat. It ain't even really heat. i just been... Boy, consistency is key. Remember that. No matter what you do in life, if you're not going to be consistent, you might as well not even do it. All right? I'm just, I'm just throwing that out there. Um, wise words on a Saturday afternoon or evening. I don't know when this video is coming out. All right? So check this out real quick. Newsbreak sent a, um, a notification to my phone telling me that DMX died at 50 from a heart attack. An hour later... Newsbreak told me that DMX manager wanted y'all to stop spreading rumors about him being dead because he on life support. Now, the definition of life support is there's a machine keeping you alive because in real life you dead. Okay, cool. But if he not really dead, stop telling. Man, I posted my video all early. I got on YouTube. I saw YouTube made a remembering DMX video. Like, we all think the nigga dead at this point. He, no, you know... No disrespect. He might as well just go now. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't, I'm not even trying to be mean or nothing. Like, I fuck with X. I'm just saying, like, I, after all of this, my nigga, you might as well just go so we can have a few. <laughs> I feel so bad, but all right, I just got to. I, I hate to end it on that note, but I got to get out of here before I say some more dumb shit. <laughs>